collagen supplements have become very popular to help keep you feeling young and looking young. So Crystal and Kristen are here to share with us how they work. How are you guys today? Good. Thank you so much for coming. So as always, we love having Swanson Health products in the house because you guys have so much wisdom in terms of our inner and outer health. So Kristen, how should I use collagen and what is it? Uh, well, to use collagen, I mean, the powders are some of my favorite because you can literally add it into anything. Mm -hmm. I've been experimenting with like some collagen waffles lately. <gasps> and so incorporating wow. that in is a great way. I love mixing it in my coffee or hot cocoa. Wow, that is fantastic. So from what I understand, collagen is great for different joints, correct? How does that help you um, as well as on the inside, but how does it help you on the outside to kind of keep things smooth and toned? So it actually helps with skin elasticity and hydration. Um, it can help strengthen the hair, the nails, uh, the joints. It's in your bones, it's in your gut. It's, it's a part of who we are. It's literally right. up to 30% of our body weight is collagen, so. I once heard somebody say that the power of vitamins uh, and and minerals, um, any type of supplements, is helping your body do what it needs to do better. And so that I know is a big part of this because obviously as we age, we can start to feel a little bit older and our joints are aching a little bit more. And also we wanna look great, so I know collagen's really great for that. So what role does vitamin C play in conjunction with collagen? Well, col uh, vitamin C can really help increase the um, absorption with collagen and along with copper and zinc as well. That's fantastic and um, I have heard in the past, let me know whether I'm right or wrong on this I guess, is um, you kind of get what you pay for. So if you want to have good quality health, you need to pick good quality products. I know that that's something that you guys are known for. Um, and in terms of collagen, what are the different forms? You had mentioned a powder, right, that you can put in your, your coffee or your waffles. What else are we looking at? So there's capsules, but as far as forms, um, there's type one collagen, which mm -hmm. is the one that's most abundant in hair, skin, nails, and that's the one that really helps with elasticity and hydration. Type two is primarily in joints, ligaments, connective tissues. And then we also have type three, and that kind of creates the whole structure of your body and maintains good health. Wow, okay, so there's a lot to this. <laughs> yeah. But that's why we defer to experts like you guys. Right. And so I know that you know if somebody has questions and they're, we're just touching the tip of the iceberg here, um, so. where can yes. they go to get those questions answered? Yep, so we're right, located right uh, next to Shields off of 45th Street in the Colonnade Mall. And we have a product specialist, which is Kirsten, and you can come ask for me too. So we're always here to help you pick one out. I know the powders seem to be the most popular. People love to put them in their coffee, so super easy to use. That's very smart. Um, Kirsten, you had made a comment about, you know, vitamin C helps the collagen to be absorbed a little bit more. Mm -hmm. That's something that maybe I don't know, or the average person doesn't mm -hmm. know, and that's kind of the benefit of coming to you right? If, yes. you, if they have questions, um, you guys are kind of the experts on all of this stuff, so you, you seem to know all the different details, what pairs with what. Mm -hmm. Do you often find people coming in kind of asking, like, here's what's wrong with me? <laughs> like, what are the right steps for me to take in terms of supplements to get that fixed? Definitely. It can be, it can be kind of overwhelming if you're just like, if you're new to the industry or you're trying to figure out what, where to start exactly. And so just starting with the basics sometimes can be really helpful. And also, putting collagen in waffles is something that had never occurred to yes. me. You guys must have a thousand ideas for where to put this stuff, just to make it a little bit more unique, huh? Mm -hmm. You can literally fit it in like into anything that you're making, and it's it's unflavored, so you can mm -hmm. add it in. And it, I love doing it like with my morning coffee or hot cocoa. It just makes it extra creamy. Oh, does it? Mm -hmm. Oh, so there's a benefit there too, because mm -hmm. we do love a creamy hot cocoa. <laughs> Well, that's fantastic, and I'm sure you can put it in any number of meals. In fact, in our last segment, uh, if you're cooking up some healthy meals, toss some collagen in there. there Just make it even more mm -hmm. healthier. Thank you so much, ladies, <laughs> for coming on today. I always love this. All right, stay with us. We have an event for future moms that are going to help you prepare for motherhood. We'll have that next.